of the game. Football! The name of the game. Football! The name of the game. Football! The name of the game. Football! Skulls. Vicky Butt, United coming to terms with its intense heat and humidity. Good shot! Oh, good goal! That's brought most of the 38,000 crowd to its feet. majority of fans inside the National Stadium are supporting Manchester United and that's the kind of moment they came to see. Nicky Butt goal. It's the direct side, the ties. No offside, play goes on. Chance for an equaliser can save by Raymond van der Howe. He's only been on the field a matter of minutes and an excellent save again from van der Howe. This time helping Pew on of his big moments. McKean proudly wearing that captain's armband. Now Phil Neville away. Lots of Neville. Kaborski streaming in and a good save by Camplian. Well, he's known as the Express Train. He was living up to his nickname then. Kaborski. Plenty of energy from the substitute. Good cross from him. Oh dear, own oh goal. ま、ハートブレイクです。3ミニッツとゴー。今日今日のイドで、みんな疲れてますが、え、ま、今日ま、タフな試合しまして、ま、みんな今から帰ることを楽しみにしています。いや、ワン、オールイズアバリーグドプ
and as I said earlier, tremendous depth in the squad they have now. Sharia. Maybe a little lucky. How he still makes it. Showpiece occasions at Wembley. They do uh, more and more of the letter of the law, the mandatory instructions to deal with. And Chelsea have restarted the game, but they can't do that. Well, as I was mentioning, Martin, this is going to go on. And he's keen to prove that he's got a part to uh, play. And that looks a nasty one, to be honest. It's quite yet, just holding the ball up, and that's. <laughs> Controls it and then Keane, well, that's more like Bruce Lee, isn't it? The match is just sheer preparation, and you do wonder about the mix after what's gone on over the last couple of weeks or so about playing games as opposed to doing the old pre season things of running out hills and uh, just slogging away day after day, but no contact. Well, I think, what you know, no matter how much running or games both these sides have played in pre season, there'll be a lot of tired legs at the end of this match through the middle this time, Manchester United just mixing it up a little bit. Keane. Ooh. And that was... And uh, Tora Andre Flo is with the Chelsea party today, the striker from Norway. As well, and Sheringham... I wonder whether the referee's going to take action for the second incident as well. Is Sheringham going to be in really serious trouble here? Uh, Dennis Wise, we all know what he's like. He gets involved sometimes when he shouldn't do. Well, he's involved he there again. again. And that's just stupid from Dennis Wise. Well, while Peter Jones was showing Sheringham the yellow card, presumably for what he saw was an arm raised in challenging Steve Clark, Sheringham was involved with Wise. They're still involved again. He's wanting to throw it quickly if there was someone on the same wavelength as him. Petrescu tried to get there. Back to Schmeichel by Keane, who I'm not sure whether he was playing it back to Keane, but he got it. And this is Granville onside. Poyet's in the middle, but Pallister gets there before him, and he had to for Manchester United. In comes the whipped in corner. Hughes! Mark Hughes does it against Manchester United. My first impression here is Peter Schmeichel. I'd like to see it again, but I think this ball whips in and beats Schmeichel. Hughes looking at the far post. The response that you expect from Manchester United and Roy Keane can't get it through the crowd. Sheringham tries his luck. Deflects away off. That's Johnson! A good whip corner, Jonsson rises above, great header. Down, skidders off the wet turf and into the top corner. That's a great header. We get a winning goal. Zola, now Di Matteo. Bowled over by Keane, who was beginning to be uh, fretful then, and with some justification, Di Matteo had plenty of space to take the ball into. Uh, Roy Keane late here. Just, well, there was nothing dangerous. I think Di Matteo has made a little bit of it. But this is Zola country now. Big chance to show us his skill at free kicks. And Keane is desperately angry. But not this time. Key, but... Price. Nice turn, but the shot was blocked. One situation. Ed De Hoy, who doesn't look the most commanding on the cross ball. Beckham opting to punch. And now Chelsea can break here with Zola. Viali already up with it. Petrescu trying to get there down the right hand side. Still Zola going on. I tell you what, Martin, Roy Keane made 60 yards getting back there. Unbelievable run. Roberto Di Matteo. 
Zola. Diali waiting far post. And Wise trying to force his way between the two. Oh, and it comes back to Dennis Wise again. Out comes Schmeichel. Ball still not grasped. The goalkeeper gives Wise a playful kick on the backside, and I stress that was very playful. And it has. And Chelsea have matched Manchester United over 90 minutes in their charity shield, and they needed to come from behind to do that with Ronnie Johnson's equaliser. Both sides scoring in the early minutes of the second half. I think this fella, one and one, to beat one and one, I have to go back to Peter Shilton for someone who was so difficult to beat one and one. Well, first up for Chelsea is the player who was first up for them in the Umbro Cup shootout against Newcastle, and that's Frank Sinclair. Charity Shield to be decided on penalties. Sinclair to take on Schmeichel and the might of the Manchester United fans. And Schmeichel has saved it. First blood for the champions. Here goes goals. And Manchester United lead by one penalty to nil. Look at Schmeichel. I tell you what, he drives you mad. <laughs> Gamesmanship, delaying tactics. Yes, if he lived in Utopia, he'd find something wrong with it. Zola scores. He's in his time. And that one is right in the bottom corner. Doesn't find it this time. Michael takes all the credit. So, more responsibility for Manchester United's new captain, Roy Keane, to keep Chelsea on the wrong end of things here. And simply now, Frank LeBeuf has to score to keep it alive, but it's three out of three for Alex Ferguson's team. Yeah, good penalty again from the captain. There's no way I'm going to miss as he stepped up to strike that home. Penalty taker. All these moves were illegal before July the 1st, but Schmeichel quite entitled to do that now, but Levert keeps the shootout going. Put this away, and the charity shield stays with Manchester United. Well, what, you, what can you say about him? And I'm not wrong when I say this, he's the best player in Britain. His fantastic idea of the game, his knowledge of the game is superb, awareness, vision, passing ability, engine incredible, up and down all day, he could run forever. Competitive, uh, marvellous, marvellous player. And you know another thing about him, he could play in goal and centre forward in the one game probably. Play anywhere in the pitch, just happy to play. Central Park Wigan fierce rugby league territory but when Roy King comes to town there's only one red and white strip to be worn after getting into one or two scrapes in the past his army of young Wigan fans say he must watch it in future especially now he's captain I think if he calms down then he could definitely be best in the land if he just tones it down a little bit cools off but still puts in the effort he's, he'll become one of the greatest players in the world he's got to keep that temper to keep his drive and ambition going so you he's, don't think he needs to calm down not one bit He's perfect. Well, that's part of my game, you know, and I've got a desire to win matches. And if you take that away from me, you know, it's, you know, a lot of it, part of my game gone. But, you know, if I take that away from my game, I wouldn't be half the player. Simple as that, really. And you can still have that quality and be captain. Yeah, yeah, I think so. The name of the game. Football! The name of the game. Football! The name of the game.